Alright guys, welcome to Los Angeles, California. It's beautiful outside today and uh, we are at the All-American Barbecue. Uh, we're actually uh, finishing up this California trip and uh, I happen to find this barbecue challenge. And if you finish it in 30 minutes, you get 300 bucks. And your meal free. And your meal free. So I figured, you know, hey, before we get on the plane, let's eat seven or eight pounds of barbecue, get in a couple extra bucks, and head back to Pennsylvania. Because, I mean, the thing about California and Pennsylvania at this time is the temperatures are very similar. So I'm not really leaving cold, leaving hot and going to cold or vice versa. It's, it's kind of an offset. That's, that's why it's better to travel in the winter from Pennsylvania because then you're gaining. You're not losing. But, uh, Regardless, barbecue, let's do it. You brought the challenges out, they're oh, massive. We haven't uh, even had the cornbread yet. We've got some cornbread coming in here. Here's the cornbread. You got a uh, got a whole chicken, you got links, you got ribs, you got uh, three sides over here, you got mashed potatoes, you got baked beans, Andy Paul would love baked beans, and uh, macaroni and cheese, and also got these two gigantic pieces of cornbread per challenge. Look at those things, they look awesome. Uh, but we uh, if you want to get the 300 bucks, you gotta do this in 30 minutes or less. True story. All right, guys, so without further ado, the big Texan challenge here in Los Angeles, California at All-American Barbecue, 321. All right. Three BBQ. Oh, yeah. Start out with some linkage. Very good link. Yeah. Spicy. Oh, wow, a little spicy. A little spicy, a lot spicy. It is spicy. Is that a beef rib? Is that a beef rib? Pork rib? Absolutely awesome. Kind of has the pull of a yeah. beef rib. I'm gonna go against the grain and eat with my fingers, I guess. 
long as they have. That fry chip is good. Very good. Yeah. Never had pulled pork like this. No? It's got a really cool sauce on it. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, it was in Pennsylvania. I live in Maryland, but I have four kids, so. The only hard thing about barbecue is eating things off the bone, I would say. Whole pork here? Mm, good. And they added a whole chicken to this thing. Pretty good. They're about four minutes in and they're pretty parsed in. Who got your name, your name? Our whole pork. Uh, Dan Killer Kennedy. Dan's already got to do the whole pork. Try to Love those ribs. They're delicious. And you're Miss Molly Styler. Molly. Molly's all over the place. She's gonna stick ribs. Chicken. And what happened? That pulled pork? I gotta give it to her. I put my pulled pork in my beans. He's a multitasker. I think it is as clean as possible. No man left behind. That's good. Is this a rotisserie chicken? Entire chicken? No, barbecue. Well, I've had rotisseries on, uh, on a barbecue actually. A little more extra barbecue sauce. It's, 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 it's soft. It's so soft. That's very good. It's the M word that I don't like to say. Boy. Uh, Oh boy. Off the wood. That might be moisture than an oyster. I'm a sucker for cornbread. Well, I don't hang out with porn stars. So oh, sorry. No. She likes the uh, room temperature water. That's some of the best cornbread I've ever had. I'd bring my son here. He loves cornbread. That's so good. Huge bowls of sides here.
very good. Mashed potatoes are probably one of the best home for foods. I don't care who you are. Soft. Soft. Mashed potatoes. I know. Yep. I can't stand box potatoes. They're awful. <laughs> right? They are actually. Got the salad. It's not instant gratification that way. Well, then you always have the little piles of like the fluff in there that tastes like garbage. The <laughs> That is very, very good chicken. There you go. I the 13 minute marker. 20. Oh wow. That cornbread's amazing. Oh my god. Like a cream corn or up a cob? Oh dang. That is phenomenal. Oh my god, it is. It is so soft. It's like cake. It's actually like a cake. Mm. This is a phenomenal barbecue. Wow. It's delicious. I'm so glad we came here. Macaroni and cheese. Best for last? Best for last. I love mac and cheese. Very good. Yeah. I prefer homemade mac and cheese. My kids prefer the blue box of macaroni and cheese. I, I know. Well, it's convenient too, I suppose. But I like the real cheese in there. Wow. He's macking it up. That was delicious. All right, guys, so that's the challenge here at All American Barbecue. It's delicious if you're ever in the Los Angeles area. Make sure you stop in here and, and try some of this barbecue. Don't pass on the cornbread, whatever you do. That stuff is delicious. Uh, super moist, super sweet, delicious. Uh, the whole chicken cooked old school, open flame, smoker, delicious. Um, of course, the sides, additional baked beans, Real Probably mashed the best potatoes. Beans I've ever had. Some very good beans. Big potato, uh, mashed potatoes, macaroni and cheese, delicious. That's, that's, that's sausage right off of that was a little bit spicy, but yeah, very, very, very flavorful and delicious. Uh, so if you're ever in this area, make sure you stop in here. I'd recommend just trying like, maybe like one or two things. Unless you think you can do this in an hour, and you can get it for free, but don't fail it because it's a hundred bucks. Yeah, a hundred dollars. So uh, check out Molly's channel and take it easy.